hello you guys welcome back today we're unwinding and having a relaxing sunday night so i hope you enjoy and let's get started so i spent my sunday at the pool i got some reading in and some sun and i was pretty drained after so i decided to do a really relaxing nighttime routine just to make sure i get some good rest and feel prepared for the rest of the week so i just grabbed my stuff and headed to my apartment to start my sunday night reset once I'm in my apartment, I'm going to straighten up my place a little to make sure everything is nice and tidy so I can fully unwind, get it really cold, and hop in the shower. It was time for me to wash my hair, so I'm starting off with a dandruff shampoo followed by a detox one and getting my hair nice and clean for the week. You guys can see my hair is pretty straight. I do have heat damage now because I started straightening my hair a lot more lately, but it doesn't really bother me because y'all know I wear my hair straight most of the time anyways. So it still looks healthy when I straighten it. So that's all I'm really worried about right now. But I'm gonna follow up with conditioner and rinse that out and then go in with a deep conditioner. While that sits, I'm gonna finish up with my shower and rinse the conditioner out at the end. I'm keeping my routine very minimal tonight because I was in the sun and I don't wanna be too harsh on my skin. So I'm only using a couple of products. After my shower, I'm gonna put on a super cozy robe and go in with my body care products and moisturize my skin. I'm also using this Venus Daily Soothing Serum on my bikini area to prevent ingrowns and I'm going to follow up with some cuticle oil and give myself a nice hand massage just to further relax me. I love doing self-care especially at night because it puts me in such a good headspace especially when I can take my time and really unwind. Next, I'm going to go in with skincare. I will have all of the products in the description box, but I'm still trying to keep it as minimal as possible because I did get a little sunburn on my face, so it was pretty sensitive. I also love doing face massages when I want to feel relaxed. It relieves so much tension from my face and it feels really good and I always feel so rejuvenated and relaxed after I do it. After my face massage, I'm just going to follow up with a couple moisturizers just to make sure my skin is hydrated. And that's pretty much it for my skincare tonight. Next, I'm doing my routine blow dry and straightening my hair. This might not be relaxing for some people, but I love doing my hair. I always feel so much better after because I know I won't have to worry about it or manipulate it throughout the week. And I just love when it's fresh and clean. Thank you. 
after doing my hair i'm just gonna get into my cozy pajamas and slippers and i don't normally use perfume at night so i just kept it light and i'm using you by glossier I also put my sheets in the wash earlier so I'd have a fresh and clean bed to sleep in after and it'll feel so good to get in when I'm finally ready for bed. All right, I just took a great shower and I washed my hair so I'm feeling really good right now. I did get some new sheets and I'm sitting on them right now and I really just want to go to bed. They feel so, so good. These are from Linen, who are our proud sponsors for today and they sell high quality home goods like beddings, towels, and they even sell loungewear. I'm so happy I finally got new sheets. I've been wanting to for a while now. My old ones were just worn and I just wanted like long lasting, comfortable bedding because I love being in a cozy bed, like who doesn't? It just makes me sleep so much better. And using my link in the description and my code at checkout, you guys can get $20 off any order over 100. I was so excited to try Brooklyn and Sheets out because I know they're known for like hotel-like quality. And the bedding is super cute. They have a lot of other colors to choose from, so you guys can go check those out. Instead of buying everything separate, I got the classic bundle. It comes with the core sheet set, extra pillowcases, and a duvet cover, and I actually saved 25% by doing it this way. The reason I chose the classic is because they're super breathable. They have a 270 thread count weave to give you that hotel style luxury and keep you cool. I'm like almost embarrassed to admit I'm a really hot sleeper and I sweat most nights. So I'm really impressed with the core sheets. They're literally cool to the touch. Such good quality and after sleeping in them I was just happy not to wake up in a sticky mess. But they are perfect especially for the summer months. So if you guys are interested in anything Linen, just check out my description box and let's get back into my Sunday night. Now I'm just watching the sun go down. I love sunsets. They're so calming to watch and they relax me so much. I'm about to start cooking dinner, so I wanted to make sure my kitchen was completely clean. So I'm just putting away my clean dishes and putting the dirty ones in the dishwasher and just straightening up because you can't cook in a dirty kitchen. Side note, I'm so sorry for my aggressive panty line. These pajamas are really soft, so they show everything and I didn't notice until I was editing this video. Next, I'm going to put on some relaxing music. My favorite is R&B, so I'm going to find a good playlist, light some candles to get some good vibes going so I can enjoy cooking. For dinner tonight, I'm making a salmon bowl. I've never made it before, but I'm using this recipe you guys can see here on my phone. So if you want to go look that up and make your own, you can definitely do that. And if you guys have ever had poke, it's like a sushi bowl. That's pretty much what this is, except I cooked my fish. I know some people like theirs raw, but I'm not really a fan of raw fish. Overall, it turned out really good. I just feel like my salmon was a little janky because I had to skin it myself. Um, the store didn't have skinless, so in terms of presentation, it wasn't that cute, but the flavor was so, so good, and I'm really not the biggest fan of salmon, but I love this, so I definitely will be making it again. So now I'm going to put the edamame in the microwave and finish my rice. That did turn out a little dry, but don't judge me. And I'm going to clean up after myself just to make sure I'm keeping my kitchen clean so I don't have to go back and clean so much after eating. The original recipe also had carrots and avocado. I didn't have those things, so I didn't use it, but that's why I love rice bowls because you can customize it and it still turns out really good. So I'm just putting together my bowl. I used rice, salmon, cucumber, and edamame, and then I'm gonna top it with 
some rice seasoning and sriracha mayo and grab my water and go start a movie while I eat. I didn't finish the movie in this video, but I always have to have something playing. I have to watch a movie or a TV show while I'm eating. After dinner, I watched a little bit more of the movie while my food settled, and then I'm gonna do some relaxing stretches just to clear my mind and relieve tension from my body so that I'll sleep better. Now I'm making some tea just to help me relax further, and when I did this routine this night, my sleep was so good. As soon as I finished recording, I fell asleep and I didn't want to stay on my phone or anything like that. So I really enjoyed making this video and I hope this relaxes some of you guys. But I'm just making some lemon ginger tea with honey and it was really nice to have something warm before bed. While my tea cools down a little bit, I'm just gonna take these pimple patches and put them on my face. This one is a T-zone patch. It's supposed to help your pores. So I just put these on my T-zone and put some regular pimple patches on some existing breakouts that I have. You guys can see my skin is really going through it right now. I have a little sunburn on my eyelids, so they're peeling and I'm breaking out, which is pretty normal for me. So I'm constantly trying to fix that. But yeah, I just turned out the lights, grabbed my iPad, and I'm going to head to bed. And I'm also going to start my diffuser, put some peppermint oil drops in it. And I'm also going to spray some lavender spray on my pillows just to create a really calming environment in my room. Now I'm gonna get in my bed and use my iPad to plan my month. Since it is the beginning of the month, I do have a lot of work this month that I need to stay on top of. And side note, you guys, I have never had a better sleep. I love, love these sheets so much. They kept me cool, but I wasn't freezing cold. So I definitely recommend them. You guys really should check out Brooklinen. I'm so glad that I upgraded my sheets. It was really the coziest sleep of my life. So like I said, I'm just in bed planning out my month. I did make sure to brush my teeth after drinking tea so they don't stain. And I'm gonna turn out my lights and go to sleep. And that's pretty much it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it helped you relax and I will see you in the next video.